Eric Mwad with Mwad.com. Today we are looking at the market plunging again about 3% or close to 3% for the day. And it can get very confusing because this seems to be the new trading style for 2016. So over the last couple of days and weeks we've been talking about what to look for and how to gauge whether the market can have a big drop. So we go to the dailies and today being January 20th, 2016, let's take a look at yesterday's close on the daily. We can see that for the NASDAQ, it closed with its daily RSI at 28.53. So 28.53 after yesterday's close. Take a look at what and where the S&P 500 closed yesterday at 31.52. And then take a look at where the Dow closed. We can see that the Dow had closed at 31.01. So. As we've been talking about, the key is when markets are moving below 30.9, on the day they move below 30.9, expect a big down day. And this is true because we can see this playing out right now. For today, take a look at what the Dow is doing on the dailies. Take a look at the daily chart for the Dow and you can see for right now the Dow has plunged from just above 31, now trading at 26. Let's take a look at the S&P 500. And we can see the SPX is today slashing below 30.9. That's why it's having this massive drop. And we can see that the NASDAQ continues to hold below 30.9, which is an area where you can expect stocks to continue trading with a bearish look. So that's one of the reasons why you can attribute to this drop today. Keep in mind, on days where markets are moving below 30.90, they tend to close close to the lows of the day. If they're moving above 30.90, they tend to have a relatively okay gain for the day and they also tend to close towards the, the highs for the day. But today we are moving back below 30.9, suggestion being that for the most part, expect the markets to close at some point towards the lows of the day and this is not a day where you can expect any type of a bounce. Eric Mwad with Mwad.com as always. Good luck, peace and blessings, I am out. Woo, yeah, woo, yeah, woo, woo.